like Matica. It allows you to add schematics as well as copy and paste different things within Minecraft. This video is going to show you how to get it. Let's go ahead and jump into it. With the first thing we want to do, downloading Lightmatica itself. Go to the description down below and there's a link to here. You can also Google Lightmatica download and you're looking for the download specifically on Modrinth. Modrinth is the basically official Lightmatica download page that's now updated to recent versions. CurseForge unfortunately doesn't have the most recent versions. What we want to do is click on the download button here for Lightmatica and it will open this up where after a few seconds we can click save to start the download. Now we're not done yet. We also need something called Molly Lib. This is a library mod that is required for Lightmatica to work and again we want to download this on Modrinth for the 1.21.7 version. Now while this is downloading, how to message from our company Simple Game Hosting. Go to the first link in the description down below the breakdown .xyz sgh to start your very own 24 hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add mods, plugins, and mod packs to your server including Minecraft mods like Lagmatica and even when click install CurseForge and Modern mod packs. So don't struggle to play Minecraft with your friends, do it the simple way at the first link in the description down below the breakdown .xyz sgh. Now there's one more thing we need to download and that's going to be the fabric itself. The fabric mod loader is what allows Lightmatica and mods like it to talk to Minecraft. So we can go to the description where we have our in-depth guide with the download link as well or you can just Google Minecraft fabric download and make sure you're downloading the fabric installer here where you want to click download for Windows. When that opens up, click save and the download will begin. We can go ahead and minimize our browser and find all of the files that we downloaded. In this case, that's going to be Molly Lib, Lightmatica, and the Fabric Installer. Double click on the Fabric Installer to open it. Make sure Minecraft and the Minecraft Launcher are closed. And then click install, assuming you've selected the Minecraft version that you want here, which in our case is 1.21.7, but this will work for any Minecraft version. Close out of that and we can delete the Fabric Installer because now we can install our mods since we have fabric. To do that, open up the Minecraft launcher and then in the Minecraft launcher, go to installations up at the top. We can see that we have fabric loader 1.21.7 here. If you don't have that, make sure modded checked because if it's not, it won't appear. Hover over fabric loader and click on the folder icon that appears. This will open up your Minecraft folder where you should have a mods folder. Open up that mods folder and drag and drop Lightmatica and Molly Lib into your mods folder. It's that easy to get them installed. Now just play Minecraft with this fabric installation and once Minecraft opens up, the mod will be installed and working and I'll show you kind of just how to access some of the basic features in game. There is a guide on how to use Lightmatica. It's 15 minutes long, super in depth and really good. Links down below. So on our simple game hosting server here, we can press M to open up the Lightmatica menu. In order to like make selections and things like that, you'll want to use a stick. It's basically the tool that allows you to control everything with Lightmatica. So as you can see here, we have a stick and we can do schematic placement. Or if we hold control and scroll on our mouse, we can see all the different stuff that you can do. For example, if we wanted to do area selection, we would select it there. And then we can right click and left click the areas we want to select. You could then go into the Lightmatica menu here and for example, go in here and do things like create schematics, all of that stuff. But at this point, you have Lightmatica, the in-depth guide's in the description below, and we will see you in the next video. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, and we will see you in the next one. I am out. Peace.